When I think of Paris, I think of croissants, I think of the Arc de Triomphe, I think of French fries, and I think of Peugeot. I think of those nippy little cars that run around France. I don't often think of Bucky's though, and they've got a Bucky. It's called the Land Trek. I thought I'd check it out, but to join me, how about getting a guy who comes from the land of Bucky's? Pedro, Jack Pedro. He's gonna join me for a ride. Let's go. <laughs> we like it. Look at my bro, Jay, what's here? Look at my Tony, this is a cabbie of note. How the hell are you? I'm good, huh? It's been a while, and I know that lockdown's been horrible to a lot of people. How have you been over the past two years? Yeah, you know, I, it's been hectic, but I, I, I mean, I'm a hustler, so yeah. I, I just, when stuff went down, I'm not the type of person who sits and like, um, and just like, Wait. does nothing. Yeah, I, yeah. I just, I just made other planner and did Absolutely. other things. I did some, did some like streaming stuff, but yep. I also I've got a lot of other kind of um, irons in the fire and stuff like that. So I always, always yes. have some hustle going. Yeah. <laughs> you are a serial entrepreneur because everything that you do, you kind of find a, 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 who your market is, you find out what they want, and then you give them what they want. And, and so we'll talk a lot about that, but I want to start because I've known you for your whole career. So I've known you from when you were, uh, you, from your first hit all the way to, you, to, to obviously your successful career, and that it extends beyond the music. It extends now to the brand that is Jack Perro. Um, tell us, um, where, when did you know in, in school? When was that aha moment? that you knew yes I, I want to make music and I want this is what I want to do well I mean I never I, I think I, I just kind of happened I, I, I when I was when I was young I was always like kind of into writing I really enjoyed writing yes. and stuff like that so yeah I, but I um, when I was about when I was standing four my mom for Christmas bought me now it was like now the now now like, well, actually it was like monster it's monster. like one or two it was like and there was a song on and Snoop and Snoop just came out that was 1994 and it was Snoop just came out and um, what, um what's, what's my, name? my name was on there and then I was like hooked Yo. on rap music from there on out and then I started writing and writing and then I kind of just started like le obviously learning the music yeah. like from listening to it and then started doing that and then started kind of evolving into just writing my own stuff and yes. kind of it kind of naturally evolved into it but I never ever 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 thought I would do it for a living because yeah. I thought it was so far you know being an Afrikaans rapper from Belleville like yeah. it like it was like there's no flipping there's no way that's gonna really happen but I mean, you are from Paro. So I mean, a lot of people go, is it a persona? Do you, are you from Kempton Park or some part of <laughs> Joburg and you've just claimed the Paro name? <laughs> no, I was born in Paro and I have a lot of ties to Paro as well. Like my yeah. grandfather uh, was like um, mayor of Paro back in the day. Jeez. I have a spade where, where it says his name on where we dug the first like... A bit of land there. Yeah, in, for the new sewage system Jeez. and like all these kind of things. And then, um, but, but, uh, and my mom and them, they all grew like Paro, Belleville. And then eventually I moved to Durbanville. So my mom still lives in Durbanville. So I grew up most of my life in Durbanville. Beautiful But so I come, but I come from the, yeah. I'm obviously a Northern Suburbs boy. I come from that side, um, from the, behind the Boerewors, Gordain. Okay. So now, so now you, 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 you write your, your first kind of a hit, you pen it, you perform it. People go, wow. And Jack Paro's born. You think to yourself, well, let me see how long I can ride this, or hang on a second. Because what I remember is it wasn't just a hit, it was a succession of hits. You kind of a, you kind of a got into the rut of knowing exactly what you wanted to do from the word go, and then it was a succession of hits. It almost like burst. Yeah, well, I think, yeah, I think I, I was lucky enough that people really got into it and I was in a good space, you know, yes. I think I got, in, I was in a writing space and I was kind of with, surrounded by people that really, really um, were on the same kind of mindset. Yeah. So it just kind of, 
it all just kind of came together really nicely and and i just was allowed to completely do my own thing that's and amazing. and 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 that's what i've always done you know i always feel yeah. very strongly about i'd rather write myself and do what i think i should do and yes. fail yeah. than do what and then at, be, at least be like cool i had i did yeah. it so that's always my my main thing just kind of representing my like myself and, yes. the, and the way i think yeah um you also people don't know this and it, it, those that don't you love cars you're quite a petrol head yeah yeah yeah, yeah. i'm very big petrol head. I'm, I'm actually like a bucky man i like I so how's this off-road car yeah. like i really i really enjoy it yeah this is, a car this is right, so yeah. comfortable yeah and it's super comfortable i like you know i like all the new like new buckies i've all got the tick of like yes. i'm actually at the, I'm at, at the moment i drive myself i drive a land rover so yeah. I, so so, so I, I love that tech of it and being yes. that tech that you would expect in like a um, like a like a Merc or something sure. in a Bucky now. Yes. I love it. You yes. get all your little uh, like all the kind of creature comfort kind of stuff inside inside in, inside everything now and, and that's really nice. Like I, I, I really enjoy that. My my land is just um, just before these nice flip out screens came. Oh. So I just missed it. But <laughs> so the next one I'll have like a nice flat screen on the front there like a fancy <laughs> the um i mean these guys were so sneaky because the last brand and i'm also quite a peugeot fan because i like i like that they don't conform to the norm they do whatever they want yeah it's like we'll put a we'll put a, a car out and 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 the, the, you either like it or you don't but it's a peugeot and yeah. you know they, they, they're quirky they're so like original in their design and out of nowhere nobody saw it coming land trick they bring out a double k bucky yeah i know I didn't have a clue. I actually saw an ad for it randomly last night. And yeah. I was like, what did you just bought out of Bucky? I couldn't <laughs> believe it. And then I didn't know I was even... And then today I'm like, what? I'm driving it. So yeah. it's like, it's, 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 um, it's, I'm really impressed. It really drives nice. It really it's chunky nice. steering wheel. Yeah. I love that the display is so totally different. Yeah. Uh, and, and it just drives comfortably. It's a real comfortable car to no, drive. No, definitely. I, I'd love to sometime take this off road and see what it does. Well, we'll arrange, watch the space, we'll arrange that uh, Jack get one of these to keep for a while uh, and then goes on some epic adventures. Uh, that sounds and then, great. Uh, and then you can put it through its paces for us. Yeah, that sounds like a joel. 2022, uh, I know that we've been given curveballs now with travel restrictions, etc. I know it's impacted you quite a bit, um, but you, what I love about it is you, you're, to your point, you're always innovating and creating and you've created um, some really amazing opportunities for people to, to get involved with the brand that is Jack Perro. It is now to the level where can I say it? Vain kiss or with this industry. He come a bit vain? Yeah, he come a lot. He's, uh, uh, they call it, uh, uh, we're calling it heel tight, spiel tight. So it's going to be really nice. It's a box wine. It's, it's, it's super nice. And we're doing something. So check out for it but, uh, that I can't say yet because it's, uh, it's, it's just being patented. But something that no one has ever done with wine ever Asin. in the world. Amazing. We're ready to, we're ready to, to pump it in and pump and oh. it. So, so it will be soon. And when and what else is happening uh, career-wise, 2022? 2022. So my big thing for 2022 is my new album which is yes. which I'm gonna do which is called um, which I'm gonna launch on my birthday which is the 22nd nice. of the 2nd 2022 so it's 2202 2022 so I'm really excited uh, about that. You've got a lot of shows coming up and we hope that the powers that be keep them all up and, uh, and, sure, and, and happening. Sure. Um, touch wood. Touch wood. Uh, have the crowds changed a little bit in terms of like obviously prior to COVID people were like yeah when, when you had a Jack Perry concert you went absolutely boss you knew you were in for a jaw now, now it's, it seems to have been people of, uh, are still jawling but they're a bit more cautious when they jaw no Do, it's not in my show people <laughs> are actually worse <laughs> I was like like I played in Strand on, on, fri on Friday and it was or Saturday see I, like I said earlier I can't remember which day I played it was so rough so it was it it was really a jaw. <laughs> like people, I think, are starved for just like yes. I'm, like I said, just starved yeah, for, yeah. for a jaw. So they are amped and um, yeah. But it was it was really crazy. And and now like I was supposed to be I actually supposed to fly to London yesterday. Yeah. And, I, and now with all the travel restrictions. Yeah. And then everything they 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 they, they blocked they blocked me. Uh, and the funny thing is like 
my show was going to be today and tomorrow and they were both sold out on Wednesday but now they've just announced they're opening it up on Wednesday again again I so saw I that think, you just missed your, your I week. think I think they just knew I was coming then you, you were, were coming like, to shut you down you know, the UK was like we're not having Jack Barrow I'm swear here in, in our bloody country <laughs> then they just shut it down <laughs> for the two days what's the it? roughest thing you've seen happen in the crowd like roughest as in like Oaks going mental like like when you looked at it and even for like you to go what God <laughs> did yeah. I think the craziest I, I can't even think of anything maybe because I was because you see it such a lot so you like it's not crazy anymore yeah and also I was probably can't remember a lot of it <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome Listen, it's been an absolute treat spending some time with you again, my friend. It's been a long time since we've spent this much time together. Uh, but you and the all-new Peugeot Land Trek, I mean, seriously, this is a car. If I had to say this or a top-of-the-range Bentley, I can tell you nine out of ten times you're going to choose a double K Bucky like No, this. definitely. And you want a Bucky, man. The Bucky's like, a, I, you know, that's the one thing I miss. I, I actually bought a trailer now because I miss um, just to being able to throw everything Chuck in everything the back and go. and go. Yeah. And also, you know, anything. You know, if you want to go and move the time fillers or yeah, you want to yeah, flip yeah. And move a couch. Yeah, so you want to like yeah, everything yeah. is just like easy, and that's what I miss the most about having a, a Baki on. And this is a special one, I must say. Shot Tom, thanks very much. Thank you, thank you, brother. Always a pleasure. Lekker. Jack Perry, everybody. Watch out, 2022 is coming your way. Uh, and check out, uh, by the way, like, subscribe on Car Magazine, Getaway Magazine, and Cape Town, etc. Uh, more of Jack Perry in 2022, including the release of that wine and a whole lot of cool stuff, too. Jack, thank you, legend. Lekker. Lekker.